Hello guys, today I'm going to discuss my favorite um, brushes and I have a few of them here with me. I'm going to start with the eye brushes that I have here. I have the e.l.f. blending brush and it's really good for the crease of the eye. I, I don't know, I love it. Some of the reviews that I read, they said it's stiff, but for me it works well. So I love this brush, it's just a dollar, so it's worth it. And then I have... Um, Essence of Beauty, uh, a crease brush. It's like the 219 of MAC, and I always use this to um, put shadow on my lower lash line for the smoky effect. So, bristles are also soft. And then another Essence of Beauty brush, I have this um, smoky white brush. It has this big flat brush and like a crease brush with a big dome on it. So this flat brush I use mostly um, to pat on like a color all over my lid. But most of the time I use this to put concealer under my eye after applying shadows and stuff. So I just swipe it like that. If you watch some of my tutorials I always do that after putting my eye, eye makeup. So it gives me that um, glowing look. So. Um, and the other end of the brush, um, this one, I use this to put like a, a deeper color on the outer corner. Or, like what I did today, I use this to spread the lip cloth all over my lip. So, multitasking. I love it. And then I have two MAC brushes in here. I have the 217. I love this brush because it can do a lot of the task of the other brushes. You can use it to pat on the color, you can use it to um, put color on the crease, you can use it to put highlight on your nose. So I love brushes that can do a lot of things because you don't have to purchase a lot of brushes anymore. Although I have the, um, I have the 224 and 222 and 239. For those people who um, doesn't have a lot of budget for uh, to purchase a lot of brushes, you can purchase like one brush that can do a lot of lo a lot of the task of the other brushes, like this 217, like what I have mentioned. And I love love this brush. It's the 212 by Mac. Um, I love it because it gives me precision when I am applying my liquid liner. So um, yeah, I have the SE. I got it in a kit, so I didn't purchase the big, the the um the full size anymore since I have this. Okay, so let's proceed to my face brushes. I have three of them, but one of them is my most favorite brush. Let's go to the first brush that I have here. It's the Echo Tools powder brush. It's really soft and fluffy, so it's really good to like set your face with a loose powder or the Mineral Skin Finish by Mac. So I just pat it on like that. To set my face. I think this is like six dollars at Target. Sometimes it's on sale at the Rite Aid or CVS, so you can just check out their uh, their um, website to check um, what sales they have. So, yeah, I love this brush. I also use this to put like a shimmer on my body with a skin mineralized skin finish, like the perfect topping. It's good whenever I went to a club or a party or stuff like that. All right, the second one that I love is the 187 by MAC. I love this because it gives me um, the airbrush look whenever I'm applying my, fun my liquid foundation. And I also use this to retouch. Like whenever, like when I go out during the day and I want to transform my day look to my nighttime look, I use just roll it all over my um, studio fix or my mineralized skin finish and just pat it on all over my face. So, I love this brush, but my most favorite brush is this one, the 188. I have the Sigma one. And I love this brush because it is a multitasker of all multitasker brush. You can use this to apply foundation on, um, it can give you like precise um, application under the eye because it's small and on your jaw. 
and then aside from applying foundation you can also use this to apply a blush so it fits perfectly on the apple of your cheeks like that and also you can use this to contour your face and you can use this to put highlight on on the bridge of your nose so with just one brush you can do a lot of things you can apply for your foundation and then set your foundation with a brush with this powder brush and then you can start putting your contour and then put your um, blush with this or you can um, actually contour it last because it has a deeper color so you um, do the blush first and then highlight and then contour so that's why I love this brush it's so soft and um, yeah I think I covered everything so those are my favorite brushes I'm gonna put all the products that I showed on the side link wherever that is I always get confused so um, thank you for watching and see you guys later bye